that particular time when we were making that record, we had just come uh, uh, off of what I would consider a wake-up call because what we had done is before we were signed to a major label back then, uh, and back in the olden days when that used to be uh, something worth mentioning. Um, we had conquered Texas and we were packing every weekend, no matter where we played, throughout the Texas, Louisiana, Southern state, however you want to put it, area, you know, uh, we were packing out clubs and we were used to uh, sold out shows, stage diving, galore. Uh, this is back when real circle pits were circle pits and violent, but um, very uh, you know, controlled chaos and uh, with rules, hidden rules of the day, you know. Someone stage dives, you catch them. And then we got our first U.S. tour which was with Suicidal Tendencies and Exodus. And we were obviously the opening band. And all of a sudden, we were the tiny fish in this massive ocean called the rest of the world outside of Texas and Louisiana. And uh, we were still very young men and our metabolism and our bodies were still getting stronger and stronger and filling out and the testosterone fueled spitting venom of the whole expression had not yet even peaked Vince Paul the drummer for Pantera He was the one who said, it doesn't matter. Our job is to go out there, and I don't give a fuck if it's two people or seven people or 10 people. Our job is to kick their fucking ass every single night, and word will spread. So by the time we got around to recording vulgar display of power, the chip on our shoulder, our collective shoulders, was massive. And we knew the material needed to be more abrasive than Cowboys from Hell, which is, uh, you know, it is what it is. But then to me, vulgar display of power, for my vision of Pantera, to me that really signified our first true album of what was to come. And it is a better record than Cowboys from Hell, and that's my opinion. Others can have a different opinion. But by the time we recorded it and were ready to tour that record, we were in our strongest bodies. We were in the prime of our youth. And we took that chip on our shoulders to every single show, every single city, every single state. We were loathed in Europe, hated, despised. But when Vulgar Display of Power came out, it changed the game. 
and Europe saw us at our strongest, smoking every band we opened for. It was almost embarrassing for bands to play after us. It was usually embarrassing if a band had to play after us. You know who I'm talking about. You bands out there who got your asses handed to you. Vulgar Display of Power was the most important record of our career, in my opinion. And that, I do believe, puts a bow on top of the story. Yeah.